Hi Kirsty, it's Anthony Gaddy here and thank you so much for the talk that you gave at the Plan International lunch about a week ago. The reason for recording this short video is firstly just really to thank you for all the work that you do. It's amazing. It's In fact it's inspiring to think about what you do and what you've already done. I feel very strongly, very passionately about the possibilities for for Timor Leste and for the world at large if people like you are given the opportunity to continue and uh, hopefully also given the marketing voice that you deserve. I run a marketing company but just by way of context I have no desire to sell you any services. Uh, to the contrary I thought I would just make one or two uh, simple suggestions in this video. If they're helpful to you, fantastic. Uh, at the moment with the work I'm doing with Plan and all the business customers that I have I actually don't have capacity to take on any more clients. So just to clarify, I'll, I'll share the ideas uh, and I can potentially put you in touch with people who might be able to help. But from the things you've already done, it seems you're already amazingly resourceful. So if these tips are helpful, please go ahead and use them. Um, I did a really good search. I can see here on your Facebook page, you know, you have a, a number of, of friends. But when I did a search for East Timor or for Timor-Leste, I didn't... Uh, I, I saw one page but I didn't get a sense of a community or a community type page that might show some of the initiatives you guys are up to, the vision that you have for the country. I know you've mentioned a couple of organizations that you've started and maybe if I honed in on those I'd, I'd find the things I've just mentioned. But I just thought as a country what an amazing initiative to name the vision, to name the vision of some of the things that you and your organizations are going after and potentially to take a lot of people with you on the journey pointing forwards at some of the fantastic things that you're aiming to achieve. Um, I know you're obviously talking to audiences, you know, the one with Plan looked like it had about three, four hundred plus people. I just wonder if there was some easy way to get people to online come and friend the country and also then online for people to jump in and to be able to keep track of what's news and what's progress against the major goals that you've set. So that was one of the suggestions. The other is when you mention the things you guys have already achieved, it was astonishing to hear just in terms of uh, reduction in infant mortality, reduction in childbirth mortalities, uh, overall reduction in violence over a 10 year period. Absolutely amazing. Uh, wouldn't that be amazing if you could actually put that on a slide and show it when you're delivering the presentations? And the other thing I thought is a three or five minute video in which you guys could potentially even animate some of these things. Just make it a bit exciting, a bit engaging and that then could make its way around the web. Uh, a, a video like that could easily go viral and just attract huge numbers of people ideally with some kind of call to action to join the community that you'd set up on Facebook or elsewhere. So yeah, a couple of other things that I thought might be useful for you. Um, the one is a book called The End of Poverty, here it is on the screen. Um, Jeffrey Sachs was a lecturer of economics at Harvard University for about 10 years. He's now heading up a project where he's got together about 260 of the world's best scientists, farmers, agriculturalists, and they're going after an end to extreme poverty defined as people living on less than a dollar a day. He has some amazing ideas in the book, and I think some of them may be useful to you. And then uh, I haven't researched enough. Uh, I know that uh, Shanana was in charge for, was it 2002 to 2007? Uh, I'm sure he's still politically active in, in some way. I haven't researched him at this point. But I thought for some amazing ideas on literally how to not only rebuild a country, but how to make a country uh, an economic, social, and other center of a region. Um, there's a book that I read from cover to cover called The Singapore Story. This guy, Lee Kuan Yew, uh, led, if you like, the charge uh, for a 30-year period and was literally responsible for making Singapore what it is today. Uh, love the guy or hate the guy, you've got to admire what he's done in terms of setting up the infrastructure and the environment in which the country could succeed financially um, and economically. And there are just some really amazing ideas in there. So if you or a member of your team has the bandwidth to read the book, it's quite a big one, but it, 
he notes key things that he did, some of which I think might be amazingly useful for you. Hope this uh, short chat and a couple of tips has been useful for you. Uh, if you do want to get hold of me, I'm happy to respond. You can reach me at anthony at greenantmarketing.com and alternatively you can reach me in Australia. My mobile number is 0400 009 006. And thanks once again, not only for the talk, but for the things that you do. It's awesome. Keep up the amazing stuff.